Hey folks, I'm Wesley Page with Super Rescue Straps. Today I'm going to tell you a little bit about our bug out bracelet. This is the bug out bracelet. It's probably our most outfitted bracelet that I've designed. The object behind this is when you don't have a bug out bag with you, you may not have your Altoid survival tin with you, you are going to have this with you. It's something you can wear 24 7. I'm going to go through each piece on it, but I just wanted to give you a close up of the actual bracelet. Okay? Um, you can see a compass on it, P38. Underneath that ranger band is a fire tender. Um, you got your Kevlar string underneath this ranger band. Um, glow string, uh, a glow light here. So basically, everything else is inside. So let's go ahead and break it down. And by that, I'm not going to tear my bracelet down. It takes too many hours to work on. First of all, let's talk about paracord. Great stuff, 550 pound strength. You can replace your shoelaces, make a bow straw, a bow saw, I'm sorry, weave together a fishnet, whatever you want to do. All our bracelets are going to come with about 10 to 15 feet. So there's what you got. Next inside this bracelet is a little knife blade. It's like an exacto knife blade. I went ahead and put it on a stick here so I can use it to cut with, saw. Um, you can fashion a, an arrow out of it. And I, I made this by using a safety pin, which is also included, duct tape, which is included and uh, wrapped it around with some Kevlar string, which is also included. So let's just go ahead and uh, go through the process of what we have here. You've got jute string, which can be torn open and use this tinder, just kind of pull these fibers out and create a nice little nest. Now I could work on this for a while and kind of spread out those fibers, but I'm gonna go ahead and toss it right here in a little fire. I'm gonna have ready to show you here in a second. Um, just go through some of the basic items. Safety pin, a large one, a small safety pin, the compass I told you about, waterproof, shock resistant, and then you can tell it's a good compass because there's no bubble showing. It's great, I've used it in land nav in the military. Very good. Got a zip tie. This one's going to be wrapped, packed with three duct tape straps. And that's how the items are actually packed inside the duct tape straps. So these can be used to repair a hole in a tent or a poncho or even a raft. It's got a little nail pick. Use it for whatever you want to do. Stick to a tree, hang something from it, who knows. Uh, I've just tore out all the nylon string that's in the paracord just so you can see. Um, you can pair this with a fishing hook, which is right here. Let's see if I can get that where you can see it. This fishing hook's included as well. So you've got about 160 foot worth of nylon string to use with a fishing hook for fishing. You've got a paracord pin, just a little ink pin that I include. You never know when you may need to take notes down. That's in the that's in the bracelet. Band-aid, simple. There's that glow light surface again. Just a few seconds of light will give you about 10 minutes of glow light to read a book or look at a map. Purification tablet, purify your water. Uh, I believe it's about two liters of water. You got a needle for sutures, sewing, repairing things. It's got the, the needle head on it. You got two ranger bands, great little objects, stretchable. You can strap down your gear, you can use them as fire tinder. I'll burn one here in a second so you can see how that works. Um, the Kevlar string, basically this little stuff right here. Wrap it around your hands a couple of times come between a stick and just use it as a, a saw. Great stuff, Kevlar. Learned about that in Sears school. So last is, uh, this stuff is made by Live Fire. It's fire tinder from a fire cord. And I'm gonna take a knife, and I'm gonna show you how it works. I'm gonna start a fire using the three and one buckle. So let's take this, we're just gonna make it real fibrous. That way the fire spark has a little bit more to go by. About one inch of this stuff will burn for about a minute. So you see the bracelet has about six inches in it. So you've got a good six minute just off this burning if you need to wrap it around a stick and use as a torch. Which these ranger bands work good. Put them on the end of a stick. You can walk around. They'll burn for about 30 seconds each. And it creates a lot of black smoke so they're good for signal fires. Okay. Just a little bit more. Now, if you see that tin foil right there, this bracelet also comes with a five by five inch strap of foil. 
which I fashioned that one into a little cup. You can use it as a signal mirror, something to create a Faraday cage. I'm using it as a cup so I can boil water. All right, so let's take all this. Let's put it over here. Fire. And I'm trying to rush through this so this video isn't forever long. So let's hope I get this on the first couple of tries here. So this is a three-in-one buckle. It comes with a whistle. A fire steel rod, which is attached in there. It's also removable. And a fire striker blade can be used as a signal mirror, whatever you want. So I'm going to take this right here. Oops. There we go. All right, so we've got fire. So we're going to throw some uh, sticks over it to keep it going. And you have a lot of this fire tinder. I just use a little bit of it. Maybe about an inch and a half for that. And then what you can do, when you get the fire going pretty well, we'll go ahead and place this on top. And there you go, folks. Give that about three or four minutes. All right, well, there's the bracelet. That's everything in it. I think I showed you everything. It's a wearable bracelet. Cost me close to $100 to make with all the little objects and things I buy. Um, thanks for your support. If you got any questions, just leave, leave a comment and uh, visit us on Facebook. Super Essie Straps. Thanks.